You're watching WDAY News. The news starts now. This is Kevin Walvin at Essential Health. Coming up, new security measures in place for mom and baby. It's very nice to see it, reassuring that your baby is your baby and she will stay with you. Good evening, everyone. Those new security measures are in place because of the Savannah LaFontaine Greywind case. More on that in a moment, but tonight. The Greywind case prompted area hospitals to review and revise security measures. And even though the baby was not taken from a hospital, the abduction was jolting. Some of the new safety precautions in place now from WDAY6 reporter Kevin Wallivand. And I'll show you what the hugs tag looks like here. Brand new baby Cambry is getting ready to head home with mom and dad and two older sisters waiting at the house. Oh, cute. But today at Essentia, the newborn has her ID documented and saved. So then you just bring this, oh, bring this over. Her feet are scanned, the footprint sent to a federal database. So is a photo of baby Cambry. All in an effort to keep moms and babies safe. Some of this sparked by the gray wind baby abduction. So it really uh, made us look at our practices to make sure we are doing everything we can. Unlike the packed hospital nurseries of 50 years ago, newborns are now kept in the room with mom, and they also wear security ID bracelets on their feet, the numbers that match the bracelet the mom wears. It's very nice to see it, reassuring that your baby is your baby and she will stay with you. On top of that, a separate bracelet on the foot will sound an alarm and alert labor and delivery nurses. You can see her there. If someone brings the baby out of the room and gets too close to an elevator or door, where security can intervene. Or if someone is tampering with the alarm, like trying to pull it off or it gets loose, that also will um, let our staff know and we'll have that alarm system go off. And in just days, Essential will launch a new security measure. Anyone wanting to come in and visit mom and new baby will have to know a special secret code known to and released by mom. New moms are also told what staff is allowed wearing a specific badge into their rooms for any contact with a baby, all in an effort to minimize risk or harm to an infant. Like, Kevin Wallivan, WDY 6 News. Sanford has similar security measures in place, including a location tracker that every employee wears. And now to weather.